Hey guys, Tails here back with another video. Now I've been meaning to do this world for like two weeks now, but I kind of got distracted with being scared and then a bunch of video editing. But now I'm here. This world is special because it was made by one of my friends that I met on my like first year of VR chat. Still around. He's called Pi Boom and he made this world from scratch and he's working on it for months. So I'm excited to finally be here and checking it out. And I gotta say, I like this fireplace. Look how comfy, cozy this fireplace looks over here. Everything does seem a bit big, but we've assessed before that I'm like tiny a short short little boy so um yeah everything might be <laughs> like might be pretty big uh from my view there's also something that I wanted to say since I've seen the world title and it's can I tell you how to get how to get to Cantron Street okay there we go it's out my system I don't have to say it anymore but the world is called Cantron Street I hope I'm pronouncing that right by the way um over here, I love the attention to detail that I'm seeing so far, by the way. There's like a GameCube over here. There's a Wii Fit board thing down over here. And I believe that's just a controller. Oh god, I walk fast. Uh, this world is pretty large, so you walk fast. And you can grab these DVD players. I don't think you can actually do anything with them. But they're here. They're looking festive. And this Luigi up here is kind of a reference because when he first started playing VR chat, he was using this Luigi avatar. And I can tell you, when you know people started getting tracking and stuff like that, watching a Luigi wasn't full body tracking, but like VR tracking, it was majestic. We watched him do ballet. It was a whole thing. Pick up the soccer ball, throw the soccer ball around. Wow, there's already so much to play with in here. So much to look at. Look at this setup. That is, that is a gamer setup. I mean, interesting chair choice. I mean, it's not one of those advanced gamer chairs. Oh, you can actually sit in it. Oh, oh, I'm just like sitting above it. <laughs> that, that, that's a view. Um, but I'm also, I'm also short. But yeah, now, oh, look, you, dang, pie boom. You can like, even if you so desire, move the ra mouse around for that full immersion. All right, what else we got going on here? Over here we have a nice cute little Eevee plush and a ship. I know what it's from, but it's not coming to my head right now, so we're just going to brush over it. And over here we have a very shiny can. I believe it's in 12k. Um, this is a very advanced 12k shiny can. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Dang. That, that's, that's using all my frames right there. And over here, oh look, there's a cell phone plugged into the wall can make a call, call your mom, ask her how she's doing, catch up, you know, it's been a while, and a place to draw, music, ambient sounds, chairs, maid mirror, bed mirror, of course there's bed mirrors, of course, <laughs> we're not gonna go into that, they're just for, like, viewing, all right, this place is massive, apparently, oh god, no, no, I don't want to be outside yet, no, I want to go through this door then, no, oh. oh wow, Okay, the movement speed, I don't know if I've said this before, but the movement speed is fast, I assume because the world is big, but oh my god, it, it's trippy. Again, we have some 12k doors here with all the reflections on them. Damn, that, lo that looks nice. Can I open them? Oh, no, 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 we're not going to the outside yet. Outside bad, inside good. Ooh, I like the window effect here, the rain on the window. These are two of my friends actually, Retro Shiba and Tube Guy. Tube Guy is the one with his eyes sticking out. Retro Shiba is actually using one of my Okami themed avatars from my Okami world in that one, which is nice. You know, that's, I was expecting to find like pictures of friends in here, like dang, I, I got some stories. <laughs> Actually, fun story about me and Tube Guy. We actually just had this thing where we just weren't adding each other as friends for like the longest time for like no particular reason. But eventually we did it. If you want to order something from the menu, or as it looks in my camera, read backwards, it says Unem. Um, do with that information what you will. Uh, we can order some nice hot chocolate with a cute little heart in it, or some. I can't reach that tiny anime boy problems. Or some questionable looking pie. I mean, it looks interesting. I, I would... <laughs> what flavor is this pie? Is it pizza? Pizza pie? Is it a pizza pie? <laughs> I, I can't determine the flavor of your pie. I'm sorry, pie boom. Um, it, it is in your name. I, oh god, the jump also. <laughs> the, the, it is in your name, so you should be the expert on pie. Uh, let me just let me just try to navigate this real quick. We have a nice little layout on the counter and a coffee machine. That is a fancy looking coffee machine over there. Like dang! Also, oh, it's shining. That is a shiny fancy coffee machine. Very sparkly. Very nice. I like the design on that. Oh oh! 
I keep forgetting to jump, and we can't actually activate this uh, 12k mirror over here, but it's over here, it's looking fancy. Once again, on the outside, I think that's pretty much everything, so I do need to go outside now. Apparently there's like four doors to the outside, so it doesn't really matter which one I take. Over here, we have another 12k can, which is massive! What, what, what is in this can? Hold on. Um, it's, it's got the 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 in it. With a, with a hint of bleh bleh bleh. And if this place is in America, probably a crap ton of salt. So that's my determination on that. Um, I'm not actually entirely sure. <laughs> Maybe Pi Boom can translate that for us. Also, giant garbage bags. Oh my god, I could, I could live in one of those. <laughs> I, I, I'm going to go live in one. There's a code here. Nice attention to detail. Love it. Ooh. I like the puddle here, like the shine on the puddle, very nice, very nice. It is raining too, it was raining. I like it when it rains in Wales, it's like extra atmosphere. <laughs> we have a very large tennis racket <laughs> for all your very large tennis racket needs. I swear if you're coming here, maybe I should start stepping back because I'm picking up large things. I need to make sure I have room to step back. Show you guys all giant tennis <laughs> and uh, of course you can't have giant tennis without a giant tennis ball <laughs> like the size of my head i have become the tennis ball <laughs> there's no physics on it come on five boom no no i'm impressed i'm impressed you got you put this whole world together this is fancy i don't even know if you'll see this video but here we are um there's also some very large cigarettes on the floor that i unfortunately cannot pick up also a tunnel over here very nice i saw a car go by um, so let me just take me. No! <laughs> oh god, there's another one right behind it. Why is it driving down the middle of the road, Pie Boom? <laughs> like, what country is this? I I need to go to this country. Like, damn, just start driving down the middle of the road. Ding. All right. Ooh, a bus stop. Uh, that is my friend Shadow Scarecrow, and over there in that picture. With the spooky avatar, I believe that's probably my friend Retrolution. And this is just a picture of a moon, very nice. <laughs> um, what else have we got going on? I like the motif on the back here. There's so much to look at. It's one of those worlds. Oh look, there's a little alleyway back here that I completely missed. With a giant, ooh, there's a graffiti on the walls. Very nice, very nice. Error, error. God, there's so much going on. I can't read half this graffiti. I am not a graffiti artist. Mariah? M M Mario. Oh my god, I'm so smart. I learned how to read. Oh look, there's there's more options over here. Particles, alley mirror. Of course you gotta have like your 50 VR chat mirrors or it's just not really worth it. Oh, this is the, the barber that we just came out of with the extra shiny door. Is it though? No, I came out of the- over there, okay. Oh, wow, there's a whole barber shop in here, let's go. And the- and the mirrors are triggering when you walk up to them. Dang, fancy. Oh. There's- there's a floating thing. It's gone now. Oh, no, no, it's a light effect. God, I'm so smart. It's a particle effect. Her, her, her. Over here's a door. I'm out in the back alley again. Ooh, we got hoops over here. We're gonna shoot some hoops later. See if I can shoot some hoops now, actually. Oh, there is basketballs here. That you can respawn. Alright. Let's test my skills. Uh, VR chat throwing physics. Always a good time. Um, I'm trying not to yeet my controller at the same time. And yes, that was like the best throw ever. I also want the record to show that I, I did play basketball, not professionally as a kid, but I do have significantly better <laughs> skills than that <laughs> when not in VR. All right, okay. Um, there's stuff over there that I'm not going to yet because I want to go in these buildings. Let's go in the market. Let's check out the market. What's up in the market? Wow, the market is fully stocked with <laughs> the same item. Um, if you want some chai Oh, no, chips. If you want some chips, they got some chips. <laughs> okay. Oh, look, a, a bush, a random tree. Um, if you'd like to buy a very large, I assume, lunchbox or something to, or a toolkit, maybe? <laughs> Chips and a toolkit, what more do you need? 
uh, bathrooms, I assume, that I cannot enter. Some very shiny vending machines. Once again, all selling the same item. But I'm not here to, like, question anything. Like, we can sell the same items, more than one item in the store. Cannot get open the ice cream, unfortunately. Alright, what else we got? Oh, we went to the barber shop, but I didn't go into the cafe. Oh, wait, I, I did go in the cafe. That's where I was before. Alright. Noted. It was a club that I didn't go into. I remember seeing him post this uh, in the Discord when he made it. But actually seeing it in 3D, it looks super nice. Oh, God. The world speed is probably a little too much, Pi Boom, I would recommend. Maybe just a little bit. <laughs> if I can't climb stairs, it might be a little a little too powerful. But Pi Boom also has this habit of never standing still when he's with us and he'll just be constantly moving. So maybe this is just a reflection of him. You can come hang out up here if you want. There's a video screen and a nice little DJ booth. This is very fancy looking. Again, everything in here is made from scratch. So I am thoroughly impressed. I'm always impressed with model stuff. Like, this is why well, I explore worlds. <laughs> you, see, you can actually see. I don't know if that's an actual camera but that would be cool if it was but i think it's just a still image but yeah i yeah i think putting a camera there would be a little too much although we got a little we got a little, little on person houses here <laughs> very, very easy living very comfy living oh the world's biggest clock just chilling over here nice 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 try not to get my butt run over let me see if i've missed anything else in the center no, I think I pretty much got all the buildings and stuff. All right, let's head over down this side. I don't, I'm not sure if you can go into the, the tiny houses, but we're going to find out. I also assume that he's going to put boundaries on the tunnel. I like the mushrooms, kind of a throwback to the Pokemans, but we're going to try. Look at that. It's cool. But I don't think you can actually go in there. You can actually see the car. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Never mind. Shut my mouth. You can go in here. <laughs> There's actually no reason to run all the way down there. So I'm not going to. But, you know, I just had to check for signs. I like that the, the, there's a building up there, too. Like, there's there's a lot of detail here. To be make it yourself from scratch? Like, dang. Like, crazy. I would not have the patience for this. Like, I've made a world before. But it's not like I've built all the assets and stuff. Like, nah. You cannot, you cannot go into the little buildings. Let me just try another one. No. Just here for aesthetics. There's also... I like the... the, the, the um, how am I going to do this? If I like reach up a little bit, <laughs> you can see the the little apartment buildings up there. It would be nice if we could like run into one of them. But I guess we did have that start room. Which is basically the other thing. Let me check the other side. What else is happening in Kedron Street other than a car? Oh, <laughs> there's a sign saying you are now entering Kedron Street. Nice, look right in front of you. But why, what, the pie boom? Not trying to criticize, but why is your entering, like, why is your entering Kedron Street sign pointed as you're exiting Kedron Street? <laughs> just, just face it that way, and then you're entering Kedron Street. You're kind of leaving Kedron Street. But if I look right in front of me, I'm not seeing Kedron Street. What? Where is Kedron Street? Is this really, what is this? What? What is Kedron Street? Is it all a lie? I'm gonna see just how far I can go. Cause no one knows how far I'll go. As I head to this building over here, maybe we can just run anywhere. See the edge of the world, see what's happening. Get a full view of Kedron Street from the distance. I like the skybox too. Very nice. Very fancy. No, it's just it's just a cube. There's no way to enter that house. Oh my god. <laughs> it goes on forever. <laughs> okay. We are determined though. We're going. Charge! I want to see what's over the mountain. Cause the hills are alive. With the sound of music. All right, grass, so much grass, so much hill, but I gotta see what's over that horizon. Oh my God, it's more hill. <laughs> oh, come on, <laughs> there's there's a lot of hill here. I'm actually surprised at how optimized it is, especially with all this terrain and all this hill and all this distance. Um, 
climb every mountain, forge every stream, follow every rainbow. Ah, I'm cut off here till you find your dream. Yeah, I'm gonna finish the song. Damn, I was so close. Well, apparently I cannot go beyond the mountains into the future and beyond, but I can find Ke- Where's Ke- <laughs> Where's Kedron Street? I, I want to get it. I want to see if I can get a nice view from above, but I, I there's too much mountain. Well, I got a nice view of the back of the of the basketball field, so that's nice. <laughs> Actually, I don't think that is. I think it's a billboard that I missed. Let's go charge. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna take you guys with me. Like we we gotta travel. With, we're doing this together. If I gotta suffer with the running, you two have to suffer with the running. Maybe this is why we have speed, <laughs> so that we can run across the mountains and just go the distance. Let's see if we can go the distance. All right, we're almost back. It is a billboard. It's just very pink on the back. I I want to see if there's anything on it. See, sometimes, like, these are the worlds where you have to do, like, a second pass because you just, like, miss everything. I also like the addition of power lines. Like, how often do you see a power line in a VR chat world? Like, never. All right. Oh, it's a picture of Pi Boom. The picture up there is a picture of Pi Boom, the, the, the map creator, in case you didn't catch that. Dang, there's even, like, lights up here with power lines that run through the lights. Like, dang. <laughs> Accuracy. Ooh, with the little street lights too, and the trees. Let's, let's do another pass. Uh, trees. I think I've pretty much found. It. Oh God! <laughs> come, come around to the corner to a jump scare car. Lo loving the effect, the, the little swirls there. Extra layer of beauty. Oh, I can go up these stairs. This might just go back to the starting room. I think it does. All right, I am impressed, and I believe that I've seen everything that there is i did not cute little pool over here of the water very nice very nice dang that is an extreme waterfall <laughs> i like it though it's very pretty i didn't notice the little all right wait 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 is this a house for cars <laughs> fancy car garages i don't I, I really try not to, but I don't know how you're fitting a car in there unless you've got like one of those tiny little like European mini cars where you can like li bait, probably just pick them up and move them yourself. Like, <laughs> I don't think you're parking anything in there, but you know what? It still looks cool. I can't make anything like that, so I'm not here to judge. I'm not even judging. I, ju I just think it's funny. <laughs> I like that. All right. Let's let's head back to the indoors, not to that indoors. Uh, wh where was the indoors? Yes, the cafe. And we can head back up here to the room. This is actually probably one of my favorite parts of the map. That and the little disco dance room, and and the cafe was cool. There was a, there was a lot of cool things in this world. It was fun to run around, check it out. Definitely come check it out if you have the time. Oh, there's some more pictures up here that I missed. Um, there is a ferret tower. I was not there on that day, so I don't know. Uh, there's also a picture of Moon on the floor. Uh, my friend Moon, you know, from, from the horror videos, getting scared. And that's, I don't know if you can see it, but that, that's actually me in the background in my old uh, avatar that I was using when I first started. The, the V1, the V1 Hobkin. Dang, I really wish those would be put officially into 3.0 because they're cute. But maybe one day, maybe one day, but dang, yeah. Wait, what even world? We're in. Oh, that was at the New Year party. Alright, okay, <laughs> nice. I can't believe I completely missed that. Oh, and that is uh, my friend Char hiding in a wall. See, look, wow, it's weird. I'm going to a world and I can actually say who's in the pictures because I know them and I, well, I know myself too. But like, dang, crazy. It's nice to actually go to a world where I can do that and to see what my friend has done. Like, this is impressive. Some time went into this. He was working on this for like months. It's insane. 
very well optimized. I would definitely recommend coming here. The pie boom I've been saying like throughout this whole video, like kudos to Pie Boom for making this whole thing. Like I know other people have made their worlds from scratch and their assets from scratch and you know, it's taking them a long time. I'm not like trying to say theirs is any less impressive, but to actually know them and know that they did this by themselves and put this all together and put all the time and effort into it themselves, like impressed, good job, very well done. And I don't know if you'll ever make any more worlds, but I mean this is this is enough I, this is impressive i would love to see more but dang i can't even make anything in blender so here we are and the lighting and everything and the fact that it's optimized like crazy crazy all this stuff going anyway i'm gonna end the video here so thanks for watching guys i hope you guys enjoy the video uh, again we're taking a little break with this one from the scares and the spooks uh, gotta gotta have that variety as i said so here we are not being scared by anything just taking a nice chill walk around the world something i haven't done in a long time as i said other content still flowing while the spooks are happening so if you haven't checked out my other content please do so already like comment subscribe on this video all that good stuff and i'll see you in the next one good boy